Football fans, it's Halloween, and we've got a treat for you. It's the opening of the NBA season. And thanks for joining us here on 2K Sports. And in our matchup tonight, we'll see the Milwaukee Bucks going up against the Toronto Raptors. Alongside Mike Fratello and Clark Kellogg, I'm Kevin Harlan. David Aldridge is with us from the sideline. Looking at this matchup, Mike, the clash of the big men. Should be especially exciting. Yeah, a lot of talent in both front courts. I'm sure we're going to see these big guys bring their A game tonight. Now, here is Red. on the clock. Mason for three. Drills the three-pointer. They strike three first. Points. You always take that. Well, it's so early, but hey, points always feel great. Pass to Neal. Pass to Fernandez. Fires the three. He's off on that one. So the Raptors will take it the other way. Mafune is guarded by Stevenson. It's right outside. The putback. It's good on the putback. That was a putback. Relentlessly attacking the glass. Parky really pulls out all the stops, doesn't he? Doesn't hold back at all. Yeah, he knows his team counts on him for these saves. And so it's Milwaukee with it. After Toronto picking up the basket just moments ago. And it's blocked. They retain possession. And right now, let's watch that terrific swat. Tell you what, early in the game, these kinds of plays can really set the tone. away. Neal with the steal. Over red. Wasted no time on that shot, but it's off the mark. Toronto's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Here's Mafune, and he throws it down hard with one hand. That's one way to build this lead. Yep, showtime, Clark, and a real important hoop. You want to extend that lead. Here is Fernandez, guarded by Red. The pass to Neal. Here is Fernandez. Shot clock at five. And Stevenson kicks to Fernandez. On deep. Milwaukee the rebound. Good work there as it goes. Finally, maybe that bucket sparks some offense. It's been a little ugly to start this game. Now, here is Red, defended by Fernandez. Mason for three. Good on the three-point shot. Mason's got six points. You know, I think they've got to show a little more anticipation dealing with these screens because right now, they're just laying on them and getting stuck. Look, you have to go over the top or duck under. Right now, they're seemingly trying to go through the screen. Hands it from downtown. A little back and forth, Tate Tay on the perimeter. Both teams showing off their range. Just another reminder of how excellent the shooting has become in this league. Here is Mason. Six points for him. Nailed from three-point land. 
A red hot beginning to this game. Well, he's a real good offensive player, so they want to get him going early. That's Daniel. And here is Fernandez. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Clearly, he got it, no doubt. Good job by the officials. Yes, we are giving credit to the officials. All right, well, look at how the points have been generated so far. The scoring breakdown for the Raptors. Shooting two. And he makes the first. The Raptors making a switch here. Reds checked in. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And at this stage of the season, a lot of teams are still trying to figure things out, Mike. How long does it take to know what kind of squad you've got to work with? Just looking at the roster before the season, a coach has a sense. But it's now, when the games finally count, that you start to identify what your true weaknesses are and what needs to be worked on. I don't agree with his physicality right there. I mean, his defense didn't need to be that tight. Yeah, especially out there in three-point lands. Just wasn't a smart play. Toronto shooting their first free throws of the game on this trip to the line. He sucks. And that one falls for Mason. Good on the second free throw. He can do so much damage from the line. The defense has to be more careful around him. Here is Fernandez, guarded by Red. That's Daniel. Shoots from 14, and he hits the jump shot. He has a particular set of skills, and they're very fun to watch. Right up top, defended by Fernandez. Red passes to Red. Throws it up high. Milwaukee with the rebound. Well, it's not easy to time an alley-oop. Just ask that pair. It's much harder than it looks. It takes two guys to sing. First personal foul, third team foul. Milwaukee shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. He's off on the second. Raptors leading by six. Dishes it to Rand. Here is Mason. 12 points for him. That shot, no good. And that's a strong defensive effort to force the miss, especially against someone of his caliber. Passes it to Stevenson. Here we go. Right here, right here. Can't get it to go. So the Raptors will take it the other way. Now Red. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. 
13 feet away. Mason with it. And that one's on target from the wing. That kind of defense isn't going to get it done, especially when it comes to a scorer of his caliber. Here's the pass to Stevenson. Inside. Mafune. He's guarded by Stevenson. Mason dishes to Red. From deep three-point range, Mason misses. Bucks trail by eight. To the right side. Fernandez. That's good. Toronto's gone three or five from three-point land so far in the ballgame. Back to Red. To the middle, here's Mason, and down it goes, jamming that one home. It could be a simple game. Work it down low, watch the points go up on the scoreboard. Timeout called the Bucks. I think the coach wants to fine-tune his lineup right here, looking for that magic combination, that ideal combination to be able to take advantage of this opposition. And he needs to let some of these guys catch their breath. Everyone is playing hard out there. the miss. Here's Mafune. And the layup's good off the glass. And now it's a 10-point Raptor lead. They've been the aggressors right from the start, asserting themselves from the very beginning. Yeah, they're setting the tone, and they're doing it on both ends of the floor. Here's Newman. the shot so he'll get a chance at the line first personal foul fourth smart team play foul. to save the easy shot he'll make them earn it at the line i like the strategy make them shoot for it the bucks have been successful on three of their four free throw attempts up to this point take a break take a break two shots And he makes the first. 
The Bucks making a switch here. Heels checked in. Good on both. Raptors leading by eight. Now, here is Red. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Pass to Mason. Back to Red. Shoots. Down to five on the shot clock. Neal pulls it in. That's normally one of his spots. And it was a quality look. Shame to see it go to waste. A fadeaway. That one rolling around and rims out. They can't expect him to miss that shot consistently. Red passes to Sharp. Buries it from three-point range. They are really shooting the heck out of the ball. Fantastic start from three. When you knock down threes early, it stretches the floor. Opens everything up. Now here's Neal. Pass to Grind. Good on the shot. Raptors leading by 11. The pass to Red. A three. Up again. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Right out of the starting block. They've been dominant at the offensive end. And that early momentum has helped them put together a nice lead. Now here's Neal. Over Owen. On the money from 12 feet away. I think he's got to show more fight than that. Can't give up on the play once you get screened. you got to continue to fight through. And Coach is definitely going to be frustrated with that effort. Or lack of one, that is. To the inside. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. The feed to Stevenson. Down low. Here's Newman. And he slams it one-handed. Incredible two-way play. Yeah, offense and defense. Steals lead to points. The defense doesn't have time to get set. Sharp, the pass to Bowen. Good ball movement here by the Raptors. Back to Red. Shoots over Neal. It's rebounded by Stevenson. Bucks trail by nine. He lobs it up. Deflects the pass. Here's Newman, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Newman's got his second basket of the night. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. Drives to the hoop. Here's Bowen. Now's contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. Nice play there to spray that pass out to the perimeter for the shot. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. For Milwaukee, they've gone 7 of 15 from the field at this point. Neal passes to Grind. Jacks up a three. Owens with the rebound. Well, that's a quality look for him. Probably surprised himself with that miss. Yeah, the defense can't continue to give him that shot and expect the same result. Bucks trail by 10. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Personal foul, 15 foul. The Bucks have hit most of their free throws tonight, five of six. At the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for. 
And so he makes both from the line. Raptors leading by eight. Pass to Sharp. Shoots. Red shot is right there. I like that they're putting in the work, trying to build this lead out. Because in the NBA, no lead is safe. 111 left here in the opening quarter. Out to the right wing. Good on the baseline, Jay. Eight points for him. Nice pass, creating the opportunity. Great teamwork on that one. Pass to Mason. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. This is his second trip to the line in this one. Mason taking two shots. one at the line is good. And Mason drops them both. 46 seconds left to play in the first quarter. There's the pick. Passes it to Newman. Let's go. And he takes that one up and powers it through. Love the way he cleaned up the miss and then flushed it back home. Yeah, wasn't that impressive part? Great effort from him to see the play through. Stayed with him. Yep. And that's the level of effort they'll need in order to erase this deficit. Owens. Owens on the follow. And the Raptors lead by 10. Nice work on the offensive boards. Yeah, just getting the touch just right for that tip and well timed. Fantastic play. Yeah, it's easier said than done. But he did make it look effortless out there. From deep. And the last second attempt That's doesn't fall. And so it's Toronto with a 10-point lead. Some breathing room heading into the break. They're pounding the ball inside, and that's where they've gotten their best production tonight. Right back after this break. Just tuning in. We've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. And guys, what's your take on Toronto so far? You know, from the start, they've emphasized the three-point shot. And making those threes in the opening quarter, it's going to stretch the floor out for them. Bucks trail by 10. And here is Fernandez. There's a screen. From 16 feet away, he can't. Fernandez has got his second bucket tonight. Toronto's got fewer than half of their three-pointers to go down tonight. They're four for nine. And the pass to Mason. The tray. Not going to go that time. The Bucks go the other way with it. Newman, the pass to Fernandez. Shot, high post. Rebound by the Raptors. Owens has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. He kicks to Red. To the inside. It's tipped. Here's Abdul Wahed in the hoop for his third make from the field. He's three for four thus far in the contest. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Now here is Red. 
shoot right on him. Pass to Vino. Going inside, and it's Bynum slamming it down. That dunk right there encompasses the storyline of this game. Oh, it does. Playing with confidence and swagger. Hey, guys, I remember when I could get up like that. We're closing in on two minutes played here in the second quarter. Now Fernandez. Mason with it. Now here is Red. Pass to Mason. Back to Red. Four on the clock. A three. And it's Grimes with the rebound. Boy, they got lucky on that one. Yeah, he's an incredible three-point shooter. So you are ecstatic any time it does go in. Neal passes to Newman. Makes it off the glass. Newman's got eight points. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Here is Red, defended by Fernandez. Mason. Milwaukee with the rebound. Inside. And a strong finish with two hands. No room for error there because he's threw it down with both hands. Pretty smart. Yeah, with the score this close, you can't afford any mistakes. Boy, a miss slam would have been deflated. Nice to see him finish it off. Here is Mason, following the bucket by the Bucks. It's over Neal, and the Raptors miss again. Now, there's an example of good defense beating good offense. Passes it to Grind. The Bucks working the ball around. Here's Red. Here's the pass to Bowen. Releases from 15. Good on the shot. Five points in the game. And that is textbook perfect. The bounce pass. Exactly how you want to throw. Fernandez, the pass to grind. Now Fernandez. That's no good, and he's three for five. Toronto leading by six. Bynum kicks to red. Back to Bynum. He dishes it to Red. Six to shoot. Mason misses. Not a strong finish there, resulting in a rare miss from him. Here's Abdul ahead, and he makes good on the way. Defensively, you just can't afford to give these easy looks up. Just asking to get burned if you do. And here is Red. Owen sets the screen for Red. It's hauled in by Newman. Bucks trail by four. Here's Abdul ahead. It's blocked. Pass to Grind. A three-pointer off the mark. Boy, they dodged one there, guys. I mean, he got the wide-open look that he wanted, just didn't knock it down. Mason looking around. Pass to Bynum. Here's Bowen and the powerful one-handed slam. He is going to work down there. Gets the follow-up slam as a result. Clark, you know, his effort on the boards tonight has been electrified. Superb. And he's the difference in the game right now. Hustle plays like that one are a huge boost for his team. The chemistry is so obvious on these alley-oops. Fantastic sequence there. Plays like that, Clark, bring a team closer together. For sure. Yeah, I like when guys take initiative and go after chances like this. Not much resistance from the defense. Easy play that time for him. They get it back. Abdul Wahid got a piece of it. And he's going up for the alley-oop. 
Here's Neal. And that one is stuffed right through. And what a crazy swing that whole play was. The steal and then the slam. Clarky read that perfectly and makes a huge play. Big time. And you could feel the whole game shift with that sequence. What a game changer. And the Raptors call time here. Toronto leading by four. Get there, get there. Now Red. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Puts one up from 19. And good. Got the English that time as it falls. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hit you from deep. So you have to fight through those picks. Here is Fernandez. Passes to Neal. The Bucks working the ball around. Six on the shot clock. The three, Fernandez. Wow, came this close to a four-point play. He'll head to the line for three free throws. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Fernandez at the line for three. He sucks. Three shots. And he hits the first of three. Sharp checked in for Toronto. Second free throw, good. Five to shoot. Course, 
Good on the triple. Reds got five. The defense was wanting, and he gave it to him. Toronto grabs the miss. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Here's Sharp, and it's blocked by Stevenson. Here's Newman. He's got 10. For three, Fernandez. He can't get that one. Just absolutely tenacious, guys. He stuck right on him defensively. Really bothered that shot. You know, at the end of the day, size does matter, especially on the glass. Newman, the pass to Fernandez. Neal over Bynum. That one wide left. Raptors leading by six. Here's Clement. Lays it up off the glass. You can tell he scanned the whole floor and found the exact right guy to feed. Here's Fernandez. Finds himself wide open and drills it. He's got nine. Toronto's gone one of three from way outside since the start of the second quarter. So timeout called here, the first for Toronto. Red, defended by Fernandez. Shoots it. It's hauled in by Newman. Newman's got six rebounds here tonight. And here is Fernandez. Nine points in the game so far. Here's Neal. And there's the bucket. Stay with it on the offensive glass, getting it done. Right now, it's simply the second shots that are killing. I mean, they've got to do a better job securing the miss after playing solid defense. And it's so deflating giving up a score like that. Work hard to force a miss, and then it's all for nothing. Here is Fernandez. Has the knee. Over Bynum. Six to shoot. Stevenson trying to free himself up. Fernandez. That's good. Unselfish play. Opted to pass up his own shot and dish to a teammate instead. Mafune is guarded by Stevenson. It's blocked. In the 
the corner. Neal with it. It's intercepted. And he lobs it up toward the rim. Here's Newman. He's got 10. Passes it to Fernandez. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Tipped. And it's out of bounds. The Bucks able to retain possession here. Just three to shoot. There's Neal with the three. Raptors with the lead. Bynum kicks to red. To end the cold streak. And it's good off the back rim and in. Red's got seven now in this quarter. Milwaukee's gone 0-3 from beyond the arc to start the second quarter. 125 left to play here in the half. Now here's Neal. He's guarded by Bynum. Just five to shoot. Neal passes to Stevenson. Rebound by the Raptors. Dish now to Bynum. Now here is Red. Defense right on him. Here's Stevenson. It's deflected. Mafune. He's guarded by Stevenson. Display of athleticism from that ball handler. And, and Clark, look at the defense. They are stunned. Love the assertive play style. It's great to have a point guard who can get that physical. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. And body control guiding it in despite the contact. That's really well done. Didn't give up on the play. Way to stay with it. The Bucks have shot 10 of 11 at the line. Nice work so far for them. There's 37 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Now here's Bynum. Neal defending. And an easy call for the officials there. Yeah, don't argue that was pretty obvious. The Raptors have been excellent at the free throw line here today. A flawless six for six. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. A big guy who can knock him down from the line. There are no easy tricks or hacks for limiting his offensive output. Here is Fernandez, guarded by Red. 12 seconds left in the second quarter. They set the screen. Just five on the clock. And the shot is good. The Raptor lead has been cut down to three on the bucket for Neal. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Raptors lead by three. And join us right back here after the break for the start of the second half. And welcome back to the second half of our Halloween broadcast.
Now Fernandez. The pass to Neal. Over Mason. And that one hits back iron. Toronto leading by three. Now here's Bynum. Shoots from the line. It's deflected. Here is Fernandez. He's guarded by Bynum. And the shot goes in. Fernandez has got the first basket of the third quarter for the Bucks. Now here is Red. Defended by Fernandez. With the shot. No good. Now the Bucks take it the other way. For the lead. And it's blocked. And that'll be Milwaukee as it goes out of bounds. Bucks retain possession. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. Boy, he is all over that shot. I mean, had it red the whole way, got himself in the position, and then was able to make the play. And for those of you turning in, we're about a minute into the second half. Right against Stevenson. Lock at six. Here's Neal. That's good, and it's Stevenson with the assist. Neal's got the lead up to one now for Milwaukee Stevenson. It all started with the pass. That's what coaches love to see, ball move. Red defended by Fernandez. Mason inside the line. Wide open shot is on the money. Mason's got 20 points. Third quarter of play with just over a minute and a half gone by. Pass to Stevenson. The Bucks working the ball around. Here's a duel ahead. Sinks that one from the post. He's got 13. Excellent vision on display. Dropping a dime to set up his teammate. to Mason. Two minutes into the second half of play now. He can't get that one to fall. Now the Bucks take it the other way. Stevenson right side. And it's another Milwaukee shot right there going in. Boy, clearly embracing the game with his whole heart there. Love showing up for the team and just playing the game. It was the pick setting up that slam. A oh, great team ball. Yeah, everyone on the same page. Stevenson, a screen on red. High post shot. That doesn't go. He's 5 of 12 on the night. Toronto trailing. Mason for three. The shot. No good. Perhaps he was a little too open that time. Won't see that from him very often. And that one misses, and Toronto making a change here. Reds checked in. And he's good on the second. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. And the Raptors call time here. And I think one area to critique right now, the shot selection he's been going with. He's missing a lot of shots. And I think right now it's hurting this team. It's time to start becoming a facilitator more. Try to get the opportunity spread around on this offense.
And now we're three minutes into the third quarter of play. Back to Red. To the paint. A great one-two punch. Beautiful pass and nasty jam. So tough to stop him on his way to the rack. It is. Love the casual style on that bucket. An important basket in a tight ball game. Now here's Stevenson. Five to shoot. And it's slammed in by Stevenson. Get this man the ball anywhere near the rim. He knows what to do. Now here is Red, defended by Fernandez. And there are the Raptors with another bucket. Nice hook shot there. That's a go-to move for him. Bucks have gotten five of eight shots to fall for them in the third quarter. A nice 62% from the field. Passes it to Neal. From about 19 feet, rebound by the Raptors. Boy, the defense refusing to give up anything easy. Love seeing that kind of intensity. It's red outside. Kept alive. Here's Mason. Again, Toronto. You know the coach loves to see that extra effort for the second chance opportunity. Well done. Stevenson passes to Fernandez. Here is Abdul ahead. Looks good. Is good. That's his seventh basket in 12 tries. You know, the screen wasn't that great, but still he got it done. Excellent concentration on the hard finish. And another great look at the 2K drive. And a close game, you got to find the edge. High energy plays like that one can make a big difference. Here's Red. Nine points in the game so far. And there's the pass to Red. Back to Red. I see it. Throws it up high. Got a piece of it. Feeds it to Red. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. There's a pin at their finest four at the free throw line tonight. Eight attempts, eight makes. Shooting two. First free throw is good. And the Bucks making a change here. Grimes is checked in. Raptors also changing it up. Owens checked in. And Owens subbed in for Mason. And he makes both free throws. Bucks have gone six of ten from the field in the third quarter. Out to the right wing. Here's Neal. He takes it in. And he could not get that one to go. Got a gun check. And he'll go to the line for two. And to look at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for Toronto. Shooting two. That's good from Neal. Neal hits them both. Here's Red. He's got nine. Pass to Bowen. Over Abdul Wahid. Bowen shot is off. And for Milwaukee, they're shooting 48% from the field. Not bad at all. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Oh, and there's the alley. 
way to set up the alley-oop. Oh, the catch and flush. If they can come all the way back, we'll remember that one. And with the ball, as to Bowen. Eight feet away, off the left rim and out. Bucks have gone seven of eleven, a lucky field goal percentage here in the third. And now they're just one foul away from being in the bonus. I expect to see them attacking more now, trying to get the defense to give up that next foul. Several teams changing it up here. Neal with the three. Rebounded by Bowen. Bowen's got four rebounds in this game. And here is Red. And he goes strong with the one-handed jam. Slamming it down with the single forearm right there. Ooh, and the whip that he was able to get on that. Wow, incredible. That could be a game-changing finish. What a play. Neal got a hand on it. And he stays with it. The shot, no good. So the Raptors will take it the other way. Pass to Owens. It's tipped. And it's out of bounds. The Raptors able to retain possession here. You know, deflections are key. They're big in this league. You want to be disruptive to the other team's offense. Yeah, little tips like that, they can frustrate opponents. And here are the Raptors now. Here's Red. He hits the back iron and sinks the shot. Red's got his second basket of the night. Now the pass to Neal. Here's Newman. Kicks to Neal. Looking to get it going. Can't cash in from close range. And right now, I think he's ready for this quarter to be over. I don't know if I've ever seen him this cold. Rough quarter indeed. Here's Mafune. And the Raptors tack on two more. Mafune. Yes, Red. Bucks trail by four. Coach, a tough stretch for this offense. I'd say they need to get back to what they do best. Right now, that's a question mark. A big question mark. Mafune. Second personal foul, fourth team foul. Shooting for Milwaukee. Newman. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. He's perfect from the line this time. Toronto, they've gone better than 53% from the floor since halftime. Shooting 8 of 15. Red passes to Sharp. Here's Bowen. And it's in. Basket number six for him thus far. He has only missed two shots from the floor. Excellent distribution. That possession highlighting how important unselfish this is. Neal finds Neal. Grimes pulls it from 20. Shots good by Neal. Neal's got 11 points. Toronto's got all two from deep to start things here in the second half. Now here is Red.
Neal defending the offensive rebound. Here's Owens. Banked in off the glass. Six points for him. Love the hustle there. Extending the possession, just generating offense. Neal passes to Grind. It's deflected. Pass to Red. High post try. Two points. That one goes. Now it's a six-point Raptor lead. That's a textbook example of how to move the ball. Boy, you got to love that action. And Milwaukee calls their first time out of the game. Grimes. He kicks it to Neal. Now here's Neal. He's covered closely. Shot clock at six. Basket counts. He's got 19. And he's been in the zone so far. Getting to his spots and going to town on the defense. Now here is Red. Neal defending. Count that one. Red's got eight points in the quarter. Here's Neal. 11 points in the game. Pass to Neal. And it's Toronto with the rebound. Here we go. One on one. Here's Newman from down in the low post. It goes. Newman's got 14 points. Great possession there. He ends up with a look right at the rim. Now, here's Sean. Passes it to Bowen. Five on the clock. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That was an easy call on that shot. Refs will call that one 10 out of 10 times. And this will be his second and third shots of the line here. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one drops. And the Raptors making a change here. Bynum's checked in. Oh, 
He hits both from the strike. 131 left to play in the third. The pass to grind. Here's Newman. An amazing finish with a hand right in his face. Newman's got six in the quarter. You got to know the scouting report on this guy. I mean, you cannot allow him to establish position in there. Yeah, and if you do, you're going to have to show more fight than that. Lackluster effort there. Here's Bowen. He's got 15. Count that as his seventh field goal, nine tries. He's shooting 78%. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. Pass to grind. To the wing on the left, Neal. Shot is good off the back rim and in. Neal's got his third bucket of the night. Toronto leading by four. Red dishes to Owens. And a wide open look for Bynum. And the Raptors tack on two more. And when you're guarding him, you've got to fight over the top. Lock and trail around the screen and deny the perimeter shot. Here's a duel ahead and another basket for Milwaukee. Yes, boy, since the break, they've really increased the energy level. I love how this team is playing. Think of the effort plays. Now Red, he's got 10. That one misses. And we've watched three so far in this one. The Raptors out in front, up by four. And we're coming back in just a moment. Get ready for the fourth quarter of action when we return. Terrific game it's been so far with this fourth quarter sure to bring more pressure packed basketball. Pass to Bynum. Passes it to Bowen. Over Stevenson. Bowen shot is off. Bunch trail by four. Here's Grimes. Chins it in off the great move. Plays with so much ferocity, erasing that size mismatch. Clear. He won't be bullied in there, regardless of the height disadvantage. The pass to Mason. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Mason's got 11 in the second half. And defensively, how do you leave him that open at crunch time? Tipped away. Stolen by Mason. Just over a minute played here in the fourth. Pass to Bynum. The shot misses. And Milwaukee will come the other way. Neal with it. Hucks passing it around. Grimes, guarded by Red, pocket six, and that one, good. In a big moment, you go to your star, and that's what they did, and he delivers. As a team, they have a lot of confidence in him taking those high-pressure shots, and he embraces the challenge. Mason against Stevenson. Here's Bynum, and he gets the friendly spin, and that one drops. And the Raptors lead by five. You know, we see this a lot. Both teams running their game plans flawlessly. Players are so skilled and efficient at the offensive end. Seems like neither of these teams can miss right now. I'm interested to see how long they're capable of keeping this up. That's exactly how you win a rebound battle. Get good position and then use your strength to hold on to that position. And here is Red. Pass to Mason. All sorts of time. That's in. Coming off the assist from Bynum. Bynum's got six assists now in the game. An elite score. Demonstrating once again how fast he can fill it up. Here's Grimes. Just over two and a half minutes played now here in the final quarter of regulation. Newman the pass to Neal. 
It's blocked right out of the air and controls it. Here's Bolt. Neal defending. Over to the wing. Fires from 18. And he gets it to go. Hitting off the back of the rim. That's a nine-point Raptor lead. And we've come to expect this from him. Filling it up in effortless fashion this quarter. Timeout called the Bucks. Milwaukee is making a switch. Fernandez is checked in. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Well, during the break, I listened to what the head coach from Milwaukee was getting across to his team in the huddle. He said, we're getting some looks on the three, but we're not connecting. But don't get frustrated. We told them it's a game of ebbs and flows. Keep shooting with confidence. Guys? Thank you, David. Stevenson, a screen on run. And off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for it. Look at the clock, a little under three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth. Here is Mason. Milwaukee foul. Stevenson. Third personal foul. First team foul. Wing. Six to shoot. No one near him. Fred misses. Boy, that's a squandered opportunity there. One he'd like to have back for sure. Passes to Grind. Hits the three-point pop. And he's not someone you want to take lightly from there. The fault lies with the defense for allowing him to get a little bit of wiggle room. Now here is Red. Dishes it to Bynum. Mason inside the line. He claims that one off the back iron and down it falls. The basis of our game is the pass. Share it. Being a great team. Solid play on the low block, and that one's good. Using his handles to shake himself free, and it's smooth sailing from there. Now, here is Red, defended by Fernandez. Red kicks to Bynum. And the pass to Mason. Milwaukee foul, number five. First personal foul, second two foul. He's 
guarded by Stevenson to the middle, four on the shot clock. And hopefully that one-handed dunk gets him going. I think that's why he went for it. These guys need a boost, don't they? Yep, especially in a game this close, no question. Kicks to Fernandez. The box working the ball around. Spreading it like butter. This is woohoo! <laughs> but you could not cook it up any better than that. Yeah! Delicious. Red dishes to Bynum. Mason inside the line. That's in coming off the assist from Bynum. Bynum's got assist number eight now on the night. Bucks trail by six. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. Looks like to me the coach wants to talk things over and make some changes. Got to stay flexible with your lineups. And his guys know that. It's all about setting the team up for success out there. 